friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Charlie. I'm glad you're here and it's that time of the year again where we're tackling my closet because I'm currently in a weird state when it comes to my clothes. I love the most of my clothes. Some of my clothes I just don't touch anymore. They're just laying in my closet collecting dust. It's also because I'm transferring from my college life kind of into my work life a lot more so I'm not wearing what I'm normally wearing a lot of times because I wear different things at work than I work wear in my free time. So I thought we're gonna tackle my closet together. I have two closets. This is number one and and this is the second one and I think we just start with this one because this is the one that you can see. I'm trying to only keep things that I really like and that kind of fit my Pinterest board because I'm currently styling a lot of outfits based on things that I saved on Pinterest and Kind of working around that motivation. I also have a lot of things that look very similar that I just don't wear a lot. So the plan is we're making four piles. Selling, donating, things I think my sister would want and things I can take to my boyfriend's house because I don't have any clothes at his place and I think if I'm taking some of my clothes, bringing them to his place, I'm wearing them a lot more frequently than I'm doing now. So maybe I have one or two things that I just can bring to his place so that I wear them again. The upper shelf right here is basically just random things. Right here we have all my sweaters, hoodies, things like that. So we're gonna tackle that now. Black hoodie number one, but I love that. I also love this hoodie. This is a beige North Face hoodie that my boyfriend bought me. I love this Carhartt hoodie, but I don't wear it as much as I wanna wear it. And here you see how I struggle with cleaning out my closet because I love this hoodie, but I'm not wearing it at all. All. What am I doing? <laughs> Basically, I think this is gonna go out, but it's so cool. But I'm really not wearing it at all, which makes me really sad. Maybe my boyfriend wants to have this. Fingers crossed, otherwise I just sell it. This hoodie I need to fix because I got bleach on it and it has a little stain on there. So this goes on the I need to fix it pile. This is a hoodie that never leaves my closet. It's basically my graduation hoodie. I graduated while COVID began, basically. So we didn't have anything except for this hoodie. So this is gonna stay. And then I have this little comfy hoodie which I love to wear in winter when it's freaking cold outside so these are gonna stay this is going on the sale pile I bought this in Amsterdam I think it's a cropped hoodie I got it at Pull and Bear and now we're coming to my little obsession I have three green sweatshirts. I'm a little obsessed with the color green. This is cropped and I love wearing that when I'm at home. And I also love the color. I think it suits me a lot, so this is gonna stay. Then I have this Converse sweater, which is also a color that suits me pretty well. This is also gonna stay. But then I have this Nike sweatshirt, which is kind of a grass green and I'm asking myself why I bought this. So this is gonna go and the other two green ones are gonna stay. Winter is coming and I'm also tending to throw out a lot of things and then I'm searching for it in the season and currently we're transferring from summer to fall so I try to get rid of everything that I didn't wear in summer and spring and the fall and winter stuff is coming in my spring closet clean out. If you understand what I mean, I basically don't know what I will wear this winter and what I don't wear this winter, so I just try to sort out the things that I definitely know that I don't wear because they are 100% out of my style now. I just found another hoodie. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> this is a it goes back to my boyfriend hoodie because this is the hoodie I stole from him and I always wear in winter, but I just wear it at home. So I think it can go back to my boyfriend's house so that I can wear something at his place and don't have to steal his hoodies all the time. And then we have my favorite hoodie, which is a lousy live-in hoodie. It has these little figures on there and I love it. And then we have some shirts, pullover things. And I'm um, thinking I'm just gonna keep all of those because, as I said, I don't know what I will wear this winter, fall season. So I just keep my things kind of stocked up and also I have a lot of sweaters pinned on my Pinterest and I think sorting them out completely now kind of stupid. I have my trousers right on this rack and here I know I'm not wearing this one at all. I hate leather pants so this is going away. This is gonna stay and then we have baskets. 
baskets, all the baskets, all the baskets, all the baskets. So, my scarves. I wear those. I wear this. I don't really wear this scarf anymore. So it's gonna go. And the pink one, I think it's gonna be a key, but I can put it in here. Then I have my hats. And this is gonna be hard. It's not gonna be hard because I'm keeping all of them. Because I love my hats and my beanies. Um, and I basically cleared them out last winter. So I really know which ones I wear and I don't wear. The only thing I have to check in winter is which one of those I'm gonna wear more often. Often. I'm sorry for the sun, but I can't do anything about it, sadly. And that's that. And then we're gonna come to my drawer that is the biggest problem. Because this is a drawer where nothing fits in anymore. And in here are all the things that I wear on a daily basis. We have crop tops, tops and crop t-shirts. Normal t-shirts, oversized t-shirts, wetters and normal pullovers. And sport bras, room wear, stuff like that. And we need to go through here. So we start with tops and I bought this and I th still think it's pretty cute but I don't wear it. My mom told me that I will never wear it and I bought it anyway so this is your reminder, listen to your mom. This is pretty cute and I can't tell you why I didn't wear it because I didn't know I had it which is uh, kind of sad. But um, this is a key. This is an emergency top. I kind of loved it at first and then I didn't know how to style it. And I'm also not a pink girl, so this is going. This is a very, very cute top. I bought this when it was a trend to wear these. Um, but when I bought this, I wasn't confident with wearing a bra. Now I couldn't care less. So I'm gonna wear this a lot more now, I think. So this is gonna be a key. I've never worn this. But my boyfriend bought it for me, so it's a keep because I just didn't come around wearing it. This is a definite keep. I love this top. This is giving corporate. I love it. I don't know if you can see anything because of the sun, but it's tone in tone if you can tell. And basically the same color as this top. So the top is gonna go, but I try and find another one that looks like it in black and then i'm gonna rock it a lot or i'm so smart thanks to me i'm keeping it and dyeing it black because i love the fit i love how it looks the silver can't dye it black i think so we're keeping it and dyeing it black smart you don't have to spend money that you we made a lot of progress and now we're gonna go to this side which is for me the harder side because in here I have all my jackets, I have a whole bag where more jackets are in. It's gonna be fun. My mom bought this for me but I hardly wear my black one because I feel like it makes me look very very manly but I keep my black one because I wear this when I go to festivals because then I can make a cute look out of it. Don't wear that. My best friend said to me that I look like I'm trying to sell them ice cream when I wear this, so I can't wear it anymore. This is everything we got rid of. And now I need to sort through these and see what is for my mom, what I think my sister would want. And then I'm gonna pack that up and sell it. This is the end of the video. I hope you liked it. If you did, you can give it a thumbs up. You can also subscribe and turn on the bell so you never miss a new video. And I hope you have a wonderful week. Make someone stay this week and we see us. Bye! My